Okay, so we just sent Megan off to the airport at 8 a.m. this morning. I think she had a great time here. And now, because it's the weekend, Logan and I get to go explore the city together. <laughs> We stopped at a place called the Lady Dumpling. We've been seeing it when we pass the window when we walk by and Logan's going to try it. So we decided to pop in today and it is a score. It's a great little restaurant to go to, um, very affordable. I got, what, 12 dumplings for eight, <laughs> $8.50. And we got a side of rice and Logan got two bao, which he devoured very quickly. He was starving this morning. We're walking around and we just came across a parade. <laughs> because it is now the carnival time of month in Barcelona. tries we found one everything else is closed so we decided to go to it's called unlimited it's an indoor one i believe it's 12 dollars access per person um and i think you can pre-buy tickets for four euro but drink tickets, drink tickets yes. but it only covers a certain amount of drinks and yeah, going, wine beer and kava we are going to the 20th floor <laughs> And the bathrooms, honestly, the best part. Yeah, you they feel? say 360 views, and they literally mean that you can see the entire city. Yeah, I kind of want to come back. I, I'll come back with my Ooh, brother. Wow. Yeah. yeah. So after that bar, definitely get the tickets beforehand, so you can get the four euro tickets. The Aperol Spritz is included in it. Did not know that. Uh, I ended up buying one for $7.50. That's how much they are up there. So if you can, get the tickets for your drinks beforehand. It's much cheaper. All right, so Logan has decided we're going to the Manac. It's free after 3 p.m. today, and it is now 3 p.m. So we are walking. <laughs> we took a train from the rooftop bar, and now we are taking a quick walk up to the Manac. walk up to this place looks so like luxurious and grand. I'm so excited for this museum. So we didn't go into the Manac because the line was too long. Not <laughs> so worth it. definitely get there at three, not three thirty. Um, so we decided to have drinks um, and look out for a little bit. And now Logan's taking us on a walk, and I think it's going to take us to the cable cars that go over the ocean. So I'm excited to see that at sunset. I think uh, there is one tower that shut down. I'm hoping this is not the one. Abby's just finding this out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> If not, I'm getting an Uber after this. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. <laughs> but this walk to the tower is gorgeous and the pigeons are so cute. So poor Logan, I think he took us to the one that was accidentally shut down. I'm working on it. But it's still beautiful views up here. And I think there's a restaurant over there that I've seen on TikTok that's supposed to be amazing. No, this is not the one I'm trying okay, to take us okay, to. Okay, okay, we'll keep walking. We're, yeah, we're still working on it. Okay. 
Logan's last and we got here. <laughs> I think we're here. So if you go to the Manac, definitely try to go up to the, what are they called? Cable car. Try yeah. to go to the cable car from that side. There was like no line almost compared to the line that we saw coming back the other way. We got a one way trip just cause we're gonna go down by the beach now and try to go to the top of this W hotel. And I guess they have like a rooftop like party area. You yeah, I don't know, again, I don't know if it's open, but we're gonna try. Yeah, we don't know if it's open, but we're gonna try. The beach is that way, though. Let's go that way. Yeah, I wanna go to the beach. Okay, so I... <laughs> I'm not tired, you're tired. <laughs> so I talked Logan into going to Paradis Par Pardisio? Paradiso. Okay, Paradiso. And it's like a sneak easy type of bar. And there is a line. <laughs> Just No one knows it's here. Okay. <laughs> All right, so Logan and I have had a full day of just walking around the city. We are now, I believe, in the heart of what is Carnival. It is insane here. like first day off since we've lived here and so we kind of just walked around to different parts of the city took the train went and saw things that he wanted to see <laughs> and so today we're actually going to be doing the same stuff but we're going to do it in like a carnival type of way we're going to start it there's supposed to be a human pyramid out by like a main square and so both of us have never seen one and so we want to go see that today and it's part of the carnival celebration that happens here in spain during february month a really cool experience. We're now on our way to go get some breakfast. Which way do I need to turn? I don't think so. It looks very crowded still. So we're trying to get breakfast, but it's like in the middle of the crowd. took us to this beautiful park uh, that's attached to the zoo. They have trees here that look like whopping willows. They have like a little pond here that you can go, con what is it, row on? Yeah, something like that, row boats. Yeah. yeah. And so I think we're gonna go try to do a row boat. It's absolutely breathtaking here. Like there's so many families just having picnics, dogs running around. It's really cute in this area. I like this Elborn park type area.
okay? Make the club disappear. It's like espresso. So try to look this way and tell me if you see the same glass but like the oyster in the VR. Perfect, there we go. So we are going to play one minute with your imagination that you are facing the coast right now, okay? So the different colors around the glass in the VR are the different flavors that the cocktail has. So we like to say the red color represents the umami flavor because of the seaweed powder inside. Then you will find the yellow color representing the fruity part because of the pineapple and the lemon. And you can play with your head a little bit, look around, whatever. All the blue sky is a refreshing part of the cocktail because of the ice cream. So we like to say that we have a cocktail money, fruity and refreshing. Not let us down. No, it does not disappoint. It really is the best bar in the world. If you're in Barcelona, get there by 3.30. It opens up at 4. Get there by like 3.30, 3.50. The line starts already. It opens up at 4 p.m. Don't miss it. Like, the best bar we've been to. It's, it is expensive, but the best bar. Okay, so Logan and I woke up this morning, went on a little walk through a neighborhood here called El Born. I think it's our favorite neighborhood so far. Very quiet, quaint, it's right by a beautiful park that we love to walk through. And it seems like it's got like a lot of families, a lot of cafes. It looks like a good like family part of the area and we really enjoy that area. So I, after we got home, I've been like cleaning uh, the floors, doing laundry, dishes. Uh, getting some checklist things done before we travel next. All right, so I am off to go try this cafe that I saw on, I believe it was Instagram, and it's a like matcha themed cafe, and it's called Machas, Machas Gracias, maybe or Macha Gracias. I guess we'll see when we get there. So Logan cannot go or doesn't want to go. He's kind of tired at the moment, so I'm gonna try to go by myself. It is like in a safer neighborhood, and it's only 15 minutes away. So I guess we'll see how safe it is for me to walk by myself. not been recording that much simply because we have not been doing that much um, I've been waking up doing chores around the house and been working on video Logan has been working every day <laughs> we've just been kind of eating at restaurants that we've been to before because we know we like them uh, to keep in a routine 
and honestly the worst part of the week is doing this laundry the laundry here is the worst part about this day so lisbon i had to use that but at least the clothes these clothes were dripping wet like i have to have a towel underneath of them i'll have to show you when i get out the load tomorrow morning but i have to wring them out in the shower and this washing machine looks archaic like that that's the washing machine i'm still not sure if i'm using it right so this i just realized this is logan's last weekend here in barcelona with me because he has to make a trip back to the united states for work um so we're luckily we have a three-day weekend he does not work monday we're just going to go wander the city and do some more carnival things think what are we doing right now we're going to the Nike store, oh, yeah. Sephora, some skincare place Abby's been talking about. Oh, yeah. And then, uh, yeah, we're going to chase around the Carnival today. Uh, it was a little confusing, like, what everything, like, what's all going on and where it is. Mm -hmm. But we're just going to wander the city and follow the drums. Sabéis, no? Para hacer Valencia. A mí me encanta cuando voy a Valencia y me hacen comentarios en plan de... Che, teta. like walked around the city a little bit today got some food got some drinks just kind of waited for carnival to start yes and i think we just found it i can hear it so yeah, we hear the drums <laughs> 